Hey, what's up guys? It's Nelson here with Gadjax, and today I'm going to be showing you how to send end-to-end -end encrypted emails on your iOS device. So the application I'm going to be using is called Tutanota. It's available both for Android and iOS. So when you first open the application, you'll be asked to create an email account. It'll be a Tutanota email account. So you'll need to create that and you'll need to also enter a very secure password. So that means you'll need to enter capital, lowercase, numbers, and special characters in order to create the account. Because if the password isn't good enough, then it won't let you create the account. So I've already created an account and every time you open the application, you'll be asked to enter the password. Alright, so I've entered my password and now I'm going to log in. Okay, so here's my inbox. If I tap on folders, I'll be able to look at my uh, sent emails and my trash. So if I want to create an email, I tap down here. And here I can enter who I'm sending it to. If you grant access to your contacts, when you type up something, uh, emails will appear from your contacts. Okay, so I've entered a contact. And if the other person has two to Noda, it's automatically uh, encrypted. Uh, if not, if you're sending to someone that has a Gmail account or a Yahoo account, you'll need to set up a password for them to view the email. So uh, here I'm going to just type in anything into subject. Type in anything to here. And you can also add uh, an attachment. Okay, so if you want to set up a password, you'll need to tap on passwords and enter a password that only you and the recipient of the email will know. Uh, once you're ready, you can tap on send and it will send the email. So the only way they can read it now is if they enter the password. So if you tap on this three dash menu up here, you can check out your emails, your contacts, you can invite people, you can check out your settings. And here in settings, you can check out your account, you can check out security. Uh, here, if someone tries to log into your application and they enter the password in wrong, uh, you'll see how many failed logins show up and the last time you successfully logged in. Here, you can also delete your account and change your password. Okay, well, that's it for the video. Uh, if you guys like the application or don't like something about it, leave us a comment. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. All right, see you guys.